The eastern cottontail is a species of rabbit that lives primarily in North America. They feed on common vegetation and are considered prey to nearly every carnivorous species that coexists with them, including foxes, owls, weasels, and snakes. Eastern cottontail females go into heat several times during breeding season, oftentimes mating soon after her first litter leaves the nest. These rabbits are polygamous, and one male will mate with several females. The gestation period is 25 days, and the average litter size is 5. This makes for a very populous species. Traditionally found in shrubby grasslands and pastures, the eastern cottontail has found itself a home in urban communities. In cities, shrubs, bushes, and other low vegetation offer safety from predators and the ability to feed undercover. Trees and open areas are often less beneficial to the rabbit, as they do not provide the same camouflage as microhabitats closer to the ground. Eastern cottontails follow Bergman's rule, meaning that the size of the rabbit decreases toward the equator. Specimens in Ontario were the largest, and the smallest in South Carolina. In addition, litters in the north had fewer individuals, but were larger in body mass, and vice versa in the south. The eastern cottontail has been a pest to urban environments, costing Grant Park in Chicago $50,000 in one year. High population of cottontails in urban areas can lead to habitat destruction and soil degradation. However, with the growing presence of the coyote, the rabbit population has been kept under control. Having been recently introduced to metropolitan areas, the coyote has altered the food web. In urban habitats, the coyote feeds largely on rodents, and up to a quarter of its diet is cottontails. They too avoid open areas, making the cottontail the perfect prey. Coyotes have proven to be strong adapters due to their plasticity and behavior, and still thrive despite habitat fragmentation and human conflict. Without the presence of wolves as a competitor and a predator, coyotes are living longer lives, up to 18 years as opposed to the natural 10. Both animals have quickly adapted to urban environments and do their best to keep away from humans. The coyote provides a valuable service in controlling the eastern cottontail population, and by extension, maintaining the well-being of green spaces within cities. The balance of species is needed to keep the environment healthy 